J.C. Penney is one of America's most recognizable department store chains. It was founded in 1902 by James Cash Penney when he and two partners opened the Golden Rule Store. This store operated with its name in mind to treat others as you would like to be treated. The Golden Rule Store was a dry goods store in the mining town of Kemmer, Wyoming. The store sold goods to coal miners and their families at affordable prices. In 1907, James Cash Penny bought out his original partners and assumed sole control of the business. Shortly after, he expanded to three stores and moved his company headquarters to Salt Lake City to be closer to the banks and railroads. By 1912, Penny had 34 stores in the western states. In 1913, the name changed to J.C. Penny and the company was incorporated. Despite the change in name, the company still held true to the golden rule. Penny again decided to move his headquarters, but this time to New York City. J.C. Penny's continued growing exponentially and with great success. On the 25th anniversary, the store had over 700 locations. It was also a cash-only business and didn't operate on credit. J.C. Penney became a publicly traded company in 1929 and was listed on the New York Stock Exchange for the first time. One week later, the stock market crashed and caused the Great Depression. During the Great Depression, Penny himself lost most of his personal wealth and borrowed to meet payroll for the stores. In the end, the stores with their low price philosophy did better than most other stores at the time. After weathering the Great Depression, growth continued and he had over 1,000 locations by 1941. In 1952, Penny's remarkably passed the $1 billion mark in sales. With 70,000 associates, the store was considered the largest retail organization of its kind in the world. After operating exclusively as a cash-only establishment, it opened up credit sales in 1958. Around the same time, the company's focus on apparel was broadened, allowing it to better compete with national department stores such as Sears. In 1962, J.C. Penney entered the appliance business with its Pincrest brand and joined with Goodyear to open auto centers next to the stores. J.C. Penney also purchased the General Merchandise Company and entered the catalog mail order business. One year later, J.C. Penney issued its first catalog, which would later develop into a 1,000-page booklet that consumers loved perusing before coming into the store to shop. The 
The first full-line department store was located in Philadelphia and was opened in 1963. The department store had 32 different departments and was designed to be a prototype for future expansions into larger markets. Before the 1960s, most of its stores were located in downtown areas. As shopping malls became more popular during the later half of the 20th century, JCPenney began relocating and developing stores to anchor the malls. For most of their first 60 years of existence, the signs out front read JCPenney Company. But from 1963 to 1971, a highly stylized new logo took center stage, and even the name took on a new form as Pennies. They wanted to appeal to a more sophisticated, self-service shopper. They changed their logo again in 1971 to JCPenney, set in Helvetica. JCPenney reached its peak number of stores in 1973 when it operated just over 2,000 locations nationwide. Unfortunately, in the 1980s, inflation and high interest rates severely impacted JCPenney's earnings. They began to eliminate several departments such as appliances, paint, hardware, lawn and garden, and fabrics. The company also decided to sell its auto center business. As more consumers shifted to online shopping, JCPenney discontinued its catalogs in 2011. The company brought them back in a thinner version a few years later, but it didn't last long. With poor leadership, sales and revenue continued to decline. Traditional competitions such as Walmart and Target, plus internet-based giant Amazon also took a toll. By 2020, JCPenney filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy and has been slowly closing the rest of its doors ever since. <laughs>